okay y'all so i have my bed down right you see the bed's already touching the tires so what i'm gonna do is i got my peg just barely lifted off the ground okay just barely and i'm gonna back my truck up underneath this truck turn and you can turn and the truck will turn with you going up onto your truck or I'm gonna go and lift my bed just a little bit more I'm barely scraping all right I'll show you I'll show you so now whichever way I turn the truck's gonna go up my bed that way So if I want the truck to go up and stay away from my straps, I can literally steer it right up my truck. All the way up, okay? And I'll show you. See? I backed all the way up underneath it pretty much. All right, now, I've had, hey bud, pretty good you? Yes. Almost got it loaded. Like to go from the front. All right. There we go. I got a lot of footage today, so I have to so much I got to get more memory cards all right there we go now I'm gonna put it into neutral I've got the key now I'm gonna put it into neutral and want you to rest the way up and then chain and strap it we should get most of that on Is this the right key? I know it is because I just had it. Maybe it just doesn't want to. That's the only key. Is it just a crappy one? Okay. There we go. Don't walk behind it, okay? <sighs> All right, y'all. I'm gonna get this thing chained and strapped down. I'll be back. All right, y'all. So. I'm gonna put one more strap on this. I am, uh... Not to. Just because I'm in a hurry, I need to make sure that... I'm being safe and... These things are heavy, so I gotta make sure I'm being safe. Go there. 
I need new straps so bad. I've told them about. I told Ricky to get. I needed a new bridle. And I go through straps all the time, y'all. It's just I go through them a lot. Ugh. Um, but I. This truck does a lot more than what a normal truck does too. I mean, you gotta think. This is my today, just today. It's my second one, just like this, dude. I just did one, just like this, just now. And I don't do, and that's nothing. You know, I could. That's nothing when we're busy. Anyways, I'm gonna get this one down the road, y'all. Uh, if you haven't already, smash that like button and um, comment down below on. Uh, the craziest thing you've ever loaded on your truck. Thanks for watching. What's up, y'all? Um, so today, man, I don't even know what's gonna happen. I can, I do not know what's gonna happen in the next two or three hours, man. I can tell you that I have, um, <laughs> apparently, you know, it's, it seems that I'm on my last uh, nerve. I had a that Acura. Well, I haven't uploaded or nothing yet, but I dropped an Acura today to get all the way to go load it, to go load it, or to go and uh, unload it at a the address that's given, and I unload it at the address that was given. My boss has called back a couple hours later. Apparently, customers called, cussing and yelling and just being what she is and uh so they told him that we'd go and move it so i get out there to go move it and i have this on my truck so i was going to chain hang it and then kind of put it in a a spot closer to where they wanted it which it was already at the right property it just wasn't at the right spot right like it was at the right address long story short in the middle of me trying to explain to the dude that I can get it close to the spot that he wants. I just can't get it directly like a straight shot beside the van because with it, with this back being the way that it was, chain hanging it was um, my only option unless I unloaded this, which I wasn't going to do that. So um, he didn't like that and he started cussing out. He said the F word and then something else and guys, when that happened, I lost it completely. And I told him that I asked him what he said. He wouldn't say it again. Uh, I said, what'd you say? Because I know, I heard what he said. His fuck, effing something, right? I said, what'd you say? He wouldn't say it again. I said, no, go ahead and say that shit again. He wouldn't say it, so uh, he said, I'll call your boss. I told him straight up, dude, you can call him. You can call him right now. I was looking for a job when I found this one, dude. At the end of the day, this is a courtesy of me coming back out here to help. It's at the right property. Y'all don't have the right machine to move this thing over 10 feet. Maybe you don't need to be running a body shop if you don't have a car pusher. I don't know what to tell you. I would have moved it if he wouldn't have started cussing. It would have been a pain in the butt and it would have took me a long time. But he started cussing me. So I left. Now I'm going to go home and see my wife and eat some food, and then I'm going to go and move it for free. Y'all, it's at the right address. It's at the right address. It's just not in the exact spot that they want it. And I'm struggling with that. I'm struggling with the other stuff. Exhausted, man. Just mostly from stress. Not from work. I haven't been doing crap for work. Crap. Which is why I'm stressed. get unhooked and stuff um if you haven't already smash that like button and then uh thank y'all so much for watching